Welcome to the side of boat ownership that most people never see because it's not quite as fun. Go fill up some water jugs and show you a little bit about what it's like living out on a mooring boat. Well guys, welcome back to another episode of Sailing Life Aquatic. And this week, we're getting into some jobs that are a little bit different than land life, which means it's gonna be carrying the water, scrubbing the bottom, but we're also gonna have a little bit of fun and go sailing in this really, really unique boat that is custom built, and my friend's gonna take me out on it. So stay tuned for a uh, hopefully interesting episode. It's gonna be a little bit of everything, sailing, and then you get to see the other side of sailing as well all the work behind what makes this lifestyle possible. So we're gonna go fill up some water jugs and show you a little bit about what it's life living out on a mooring ball, which means I need to go get water because I don't have a water maker. So, you know, as soon as you get a boat, the chores really never go away. They just change instead of doing uh, like mowing, instead of mowing the lawn, you have to scrape the bottom of the boat. Instead of fixing a car, which I still have, you just fix a boat all the time because it's always broken. Yeah, are you helping out? Well, time for round two of water. Well, on the bright side, the water looks pretty clear today. Scuba diving tank is loaded up. There's 50 foot of diving hose. Fiona and propane. Time to head back out to the boat and get to the dirty work. Welcome to the side of boat ownership that most people never see because it's not quite as fun.
All right, y'all. Well, the boat is cleaned up. Water is turned off. Fiona! I am gonna go to the bar and eat a hamburger because my neck hurts and that sounds amazing. And I'm gonna go drink like at least two or three beers and probably go help my friends on shore because they're working on some other boats. But on the bright side, mine is finally clean. Alrighty, today is the fun day. Fiona's all life jacketed up. You ready to go for an adventure? We're going sailing today, little girl. All right, time to lock up the boat and get out of here. <laughs> there is the trimaran right there. And our French Canadian friend, Sam. French Canadian? Canadian. He's Canadian for sure. One, two, three holes. <laughs> Good morning. Fiona, what do you think about the tramp? She's got her life jacket on. Just like that, we are out of here. Anchors up, we're turning this big boat around. Well, right now we are flying baby jib only and we're doing 6.3 knots. Fiona's asleep. Sam is also asleep and we are absolutely moving downwind. We're gonna be home very fast. I like trimarans, this is fun. Seven knots, baby. Woohoo! Heading back in. Fiona, what are you doing out there? Come here. Come here, good girl. Is it? Yeah. Good girl. Good sail.
the parking spot. Well, we just got back and one of the other cruisers got bit by a stray dog in the bay. So Fiona and I, the good stray, are taking them to the hospital. We just dropped them off and now I gotta go in and translate for Spanish. So hopefully we'll be back home soon. Bye y'all. One quick update here. It's approaching four hours now at the hospital and they still haven't been seen yet. Um, so I guess maybe just a fair warning, do not get sick in Puerto Rico because my friend, well, I didn't even know him. They're just other cruisers got bit by a dog walking back from the supermarket. And, and welcome back aboard Life Aquatic. The camera actually died in the car. So here we are back aboard the boat. Anyways, end of the story goes, my friend got IV treatment and some antibiotics, but was not able to get the actual shot she needed in order to help prevent rabies. So I ended up getting a flight back to the States the next day. Um, and honestly, I didn't know these people at all, but it's just lending a hand and especially in the cruising community, you'll always find amazing people. So sometimes you just have to pay it forward. Anyways, I hope you guys really enjoyed this episode. It shows a little bit of all, all the work that goes into this lifestyle plus a little bit of the fun side and some of the other people you get to meet, like my friend Sam that took me sailing on his trimaran. So if you guys really enjoyed this video, please leave a like or feel free to subscribe. And if you have any comments, feel free to leave those below and I'll try and get back to you. Thanks for watching everyone.